This module will show you how to add a photo to your screen as well as a bitmap or a static image and how to format the photo date. To add a photo, go to your data tab on the left, look down the list under card holders and you have two choices, a photo share, which I'll put in on here as a photo, or you could choose photo and also put that on there as a photo field. I'm going to remove the label, right click and choose cut. I'll select the photo box again and go over to properties on the right. We need to tell the screen where to save that photo to. Since I'm saving it to uh, the photo share, I want to save it to a file share. If I were saving it to the database, the relation would be cardholders.photo, but since I'm using a file share, it's cardholders.photo share. The file share name was configured in another module. We just select that and hit OK. This is how the photo will be labeled. The capture source refers to the camera. The camera that I'm using is a Nikon, which is a WIA device, stands for Windows Imaging Acquisition. Auto select is set to true by default. That means that when you go to add a card holder or view a card holder, the screen automatically looks for your camera. If you are going to be importing your photos, you may want to set that to false so that when you open your screen you don't get a message saying that it cannot find your camera. Now I want to add a static bitmap, so I'll go to my toolbox and put a picture box onto the screen. Now to get the image on there, I go to Properties, look down the list for Image, and then browse to the bitmap that I want to use. In my case I'm finding a logo. Open that up, but now see that we are looking at the uh, bitmap here, but it's looking for the actual size of that bitmap. To change that, we can go to Size Mode and change Normal to Stretch Image. This way, we can size up the control, and no matter how big or small that we make it, the logo or image will stay within the confines of that control. If we look down below here, we have the photo date. We can configure the photo date with any format that is available under Properties. At the very top here, there's a date time format. If you hit that drop down box, there are many choices for date as well as date and time. If you choose one from there, look down the list to where it says Format and change Long to Custom. Now you will see your photo date in the format that you want to. Save your work.